We've got two more late cards coming in, just like those last bets getting in the window, you know? So, Chris King, come on up here and give us three minutes. You have uh, to give you a name for the record first. Thank you very much for being here today, sir. Thank you, uh, Chairman Liz. Thank you, uh, Board of Supervisors, for the opportunity to speak for, uh, before you today. Uh, before I truly get started, I want to thank the people that came up here and actually discussed the naloxone and Narcan. Um, I went through, as an Arizona Ranger, we went, we actually go through training as well. And we actually do, some of us actually do carry the Narcan as, you know, part of it. And it's, it is strictly volunteer. And it's something that, I've watched several videos and I've seen several people who can actually uh, reverse the effects of it. And I don't personally know anybody who's been affected by opioids. However, I do want to make sure that I, as a layperson, still have that capability to reach out to the people of Hume County and the city of Tucson. Uh, what I did hand Ms. Castaneda from the uh, clerk of the board is a resolution. Uh, that I drafted kind of as part of uh, being the chair of Prop 463, uh, the Stop Prop 463 Robots Committee. And it reads that, as this. Whereas in 2015, the County Board of Supervisors at the urge of the County Administrator placed $815 million in bonds on the ballot, only to have them fail. Whereas in 2018, the County Board of Supervisors at the urge of the County Administrator placed $430 million in bonds on the ballot, only to have it fail. Whereas for over 20 years, Chuck Huckleberry has been the county administrator for Pima County, where he's been adamant in spending money contrary to the wishes of the taxpayer, where he's been self-serving to create a bike path named after himself to the detriment of the roads, where he has mortgaged county buildings to do the work taxpayers have voted against, where he has sacrificed public safety to the detriment of taxpayers by failing to provide for pay raises for Pima County deputies, where he has advocated for deals that provide no direct benefit for the majority of Pima County taxpayers in acquiring golf courses, where he has spearheaded the purchase of a bowling alley for over 30% of appraised value while removing it from the tax roll while allowing the previous owner to remove property that is inherent to the build to building while furthermore allowing the owner to occupy the same structure rent free for over a year. Now therefore be it resolved on the 20th day of November 2018, the we, the taxpayers of Pima County, declare we have no confidence and County Administrator Chuck Huckleberry and respectfully request the Board of Supervisors to terminate his contract for the terms effective immediately. The question is to the majority of the board, have any of you ever stopped Administrator Huckleberry from spending taxpayer dollars? Have any of you ever said no? Thank you. 